Hello everyone, how are we all doing? That was really bizarre. Uh, the intro uh, video wasn't working, which worked when it tested, uh, but it didn't work just now. Uh, I hope you're all doing well. Uh, my name is Miles Dyer and welcome to another PSVR 2 Let's Play of Fantavision. Um, how are we all doing chat? I'm just going to type hello in the chat to make sure it's all working. Um, I am tempted to try and give this one last go, but um, yeah. Let's have a look. Nope. Nope. Not working. <laughs> How are we all doing? Um, here in the UK, uh, it is November 4th at the point of this recording. And on November 5th is Bonfire Night, where we like to have lots and lots of fireworks. Um, I don't really engage in that anymore. Um, I always think about how cruel it is to all the animals. Um, but what better way to enjoy fireworks than in the world of PSVR 2? Um, so yeah, um, interesting beginning uh, with that uh, frozen image. Uh, so thanks for bearing with me. And uh, this was developed by Cosmo Mashia. Um, I think it was based on a PlayStation 2 game. I think the original one, Fantavision. I've never played these before. I don't know a lot about it other than fireworks. Seem like a good fit for today. So do hit the like button if you haven't already. Uh, and subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about all future Let's Plays. Wow, this is kind of cool, being in the water. This is nice. Um, one weird thing when setting up this game, though, was you had to select VR mode with the DualSense controller. And then I thought, oh, am I playing with the DualSense controller? And it's like, oh, no, I'm using the uh, the regular uh, the Sense controller. So um, PSVR 2 off. Well, I assume that turns it off. Um, I'm in it at the moment. Let's have a look at options, video, uh, ground brightness. Black, normal. We'll do normal. Color by note. Uh, okay. All right. Let's have a look here. Let's just play the game. <laughs> easy, easy game. Stage one. Sure. I have no idea. I have no idea what's going on. Welcome to Fantavision. Please enjoy this fantastic journey. So. I'm just connecting. Oh, what about... Right. So catching is L2. Ah, oh, and then you flash him with that button. Wow, look at this. This is cool. Right. I have no idea what's going on. Do you know what? I thought they were going to tell you how to play. Basic rules. Here we go, guys. The basic rules of this game Welcome is about to ensue. All. To the fantastical well, at least it's done as a video. Fantavision. To help you enjoy yourself to the fullest, we've prepared a four-part tutorial. Basic rules and advanced rules one, two, and three. Mm -hmm. First off, let's get you familiar with the basic rules That's so you I'm can here. start your own cracking Fantavision fireworks fiestas. Crackling. Okay, so here are the basic rules. In Fantavision, you detonate firework flares as they appear in the sky. The red circle in the middle of the screen is your cursor. Which you don't have You'll on VR. You'll be using this cursor to detonate flares. Let's give it a try. Move the left stick to control the guideline that extends from your cursor. Line up the guideline with a flare and press the catch button to move the cursor to the flare. You've now captured the flare. <laughs> catch three or more flares of the same color and the catch display at the top of the screen will flash. It means you can now press the flash button. Yeah, she's got a very relaxing voice, doesn't she? Display. I don't know if that's kind of the vibe you want for this. You've detonated your first flares. So it's well Keep done, but I haven't done anything. Flares that appear in the sky. Yep. Be careful. After a set period of time, the flares will disappear, and the life gauge at the bottom of the screen will decrease. Captured flares will also disappear if you do not detonate them after a period of time. Okay. Detonating flares can restore a small portion of the life gauge. However, if you miss a lot of flares in a row 
and the life gauge reaches zero, that's game over. Okay, there we go. You're all set for your first Fantavision fireworks show. Okay, for more okay. details on how to play, be sure to check out the advanced rules. I mean, I think let's just go into it. We'll go back to the advanced rules. Uh, can, I, can we uh, start from the beginning? There we go. Here we go. This game is banging. I love it. Welcome Great. To Fantavision. Here we go. Please There's a lot of aliasing, which is a bit annoying. Woo! Three chains. There we go. Can you do them? Three chains. I guess those multi coloured ones you can. Five chains. Oh. Four chains. Star. Energy up. Bonus. Okay. Point. Energy up. Energy up. Here we go. Seventeen chains. Something over there falling down, right? We got this. Six chains. Oh. Star. Star. Bonus point. It's got a very soothing Four voice. Chains. I mean, Too I dig busy. it. Too busy. What? Music's cool. Chilled. I like that we're slowly moving Very across good. the sky. Five chains. Oh. Five chains. Star. Energy up. Energy up. Energy up. That one blew a bit too close to the the the, the ground. Seventeen chains. Could have killed someone. Wonderful. Should I do that? Because it's star as well? No. Five chains. Seven chains. Too easy. Too busy. What? Free shield. Five chains. Star. I mean, at the moment, I'm having a pretty chill time. Uh, I like how you slowly move around. I think if you're into stuff like Tetris effects and that, I mean, obviously, I. How's my life bar? Oh shit, my life bar is super low. is up but it's pretty low star 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 look at this I think that was it master chain master chain nine chains it's not letting me select oh it's game over that's why see you again I mean, the environments are cool, just like the resolution is pretty abysmal. Like, there's a lot of aliasing. I, and, you know, I think the backgrounds are important, but that was kind of cool. That was kind of cool. My success rate was alright. Music's nice. Like, there's a bit of Pong in the background here. I'm not sure what that's about, but... Being in the water's cool, man. The way the waves come up to you. Yeah, the gameplay is explosive. Very good. I like this. All this background stuff is weird, but kind of cool. Right, let's go to Advanced Rules 1. Here we go, guys. Advanced Rules 1 covers chain reactions and firework types. Okay. So. Flares will explode after you detonate them. Yep. Explosions that touch other flares of the same color will cause them to detonate too. This is called a chain reaction. Wow. 
good. Detonate flares strategically to activate chain reactions. Okay. So you won't have to capture every single uh, flare Ah, okay, so you don't have to capture them all. That's good. That's good to know. That's good to know. So when you have those different star ones, it will take care of things. in different patterns when detonated. Okay. Got a daisy. Let's go over the differences. And a peony? P peony? Is that These are daisy peony flares. Peony. They explode in a circular pattern when detonated. Next are the willow and splash Are these flares. official firework terms? Because if so, I'm actually these having a bit of an education here. downward pattern when detonated. That means they linger in the air for a longer time than daisy or peony explosions. Okay. This is a wide flare. It explodes in a wide area at the top of the screen. Lastly, the multi-flare. Multi-flares split into smaller flares when detonated. And you can do it, you can do it again. Press the flash button again to detonate, to detonate the, the smaller, smaller flares. flares. Okay. It's good to know. Learning how each type of firework behaves will open up more strategies for you to use while playing. This concludes the explanation on chain reactions. She is so chilled. Types. These waves are awesome. <laughs> I mean, I think the water's great in this. Right, we're gonna we're gonna go back and then we'll we'll learn some more. So, uh, game. What's easy? Dynamic mode. What do we think dynamic mode is? There's only one stage. Is it? Cause, oh, I don't know. Okay. Right, we're doing it again. Let's see if we can do better. Please enjoy this fantastic journey. Three chains. Three chains. Okay, I'm already learning this. Star. Thirteen chains. Very good. Five chains. Bonus points. Wow, that was good. Two daisies. Eleven chains. Good. Energy up. Seven chains. No, I can't unchain them. Fifteen chains. Wonderful. Star. Okay, this is going good. Doing a lot better this time. 14 chains. Wonderful. Whoa, look at all these. Star. Bonus points. Energy up. Bonus points. Okay, I'm doing a lot better this time. Chains. Fantastic. Bonus points. Oh, it's when the, the chain ones explode, I... This is pretty, uh, I'm going to say, Energy up. this is uh, pretty chill, man. This is like classic arcade games, it feels like. Bonus it's awesome. Bonus points. Too easy. Bonus points. Energy up. Energy up. Star. Wow, I'm doing a lot Last better this time, time, right? Fantastic. Bonus points. Bonus points. Energy up. I love bonus points. Master chain. Fantastic. 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 Just so complimentary. Thirteen chains. Very good. Bonus points. This is quite hypnotic. And I'm liking it. I just wish the resolution was better on the scenery, even though that's not what you're Great. looking on, really. Energy up. Star. Bonus points. Energy up. God, I'm doing a lot better, aren't I? I think this is like where I lost last time. 
20 second chain. Great. Star. Bonus point. Can you start new chains by selecting new colours? Is that what happens? 12 chains. Very good. I love the music. Whoa! Star mine. Star mine? I mean, what? Okay, I need to learn about this now. I don't know. This is awesome. 11 chains. Good. Oh, I missed loads then. Whoa. Master chain. Whoa. 17 chains. I'm like, why would you why would you not play this in VR? Why would you Yeah, I'll watch the advance the rest of the advanced tips. Oh cool, it tells you what's coming up next. I didn't notice that last time. Energy up. Fourteen chains. No. Wonderful. Star. Bonus point. Yeah, bonus mini stage that star mine was. It's very cute. Star. Bonus point. Energy up. Master chain. Fantastic. Fantastic. Four chains. Bonus points. Energy up. Bonus points. Fifteen chains. I mean, where are they setting these fireworks off from? The neighbours must Three not chains. be happy. They're like... Oh. Five chains. Way We cleaned the stage. There's a plane. I mean, I'm having a really good time, but am I going to keep coming back to this game? I'm not sure. I mean, it's very early to say. Save as replay? No. Nah. We got it on the live stream. You can can watch it back whenever we want. Oh, look, it tells you the route there. That's kind of cool. Three chains. I'm a fantastic chain master, thank you very much. I have no idea how I uh I guess maybe I'm in the wrong career. Maybe I should be a fireworks person. When I um went to secondary school or high school as you say in the States, our chemistry teacher actually made fireworks that they used at the school firework display. I mean talk about practicing what you preach. Thought it was awesome. Although I wonder if it was legal. Energy up. I assume you can't Energy just up. make fireworks. You need a license, right? Twenty-seven chains. Great. Energy up. Seven chains. I'm definitely clicking on more than I need to. Because if you time it right. Bonus point. Bonus point. Star. Bonus point. Energy up. Those letters are really good for like Master filling in the chains. gaps if you don't have enough colours. Three chains. Eight chains. Energy up. Bonus point. Energy up. Energy up. If anyone's Bonus watching and just doesn't know what's going on, up. just enjoy the firework display. Twenty-four chains. I feel like Great. a bit of a conductor. I don't want to let these people down. Nine I want to make sure they're having a good time. Star. Did my chemistry teacher or so make crystal meth? I'm being asked. Um, not that I was aware of. Twenty-one chains. At least Great. there was none on fireworks Bonus night at the school. Five chains. Three chains. Star. Star. Bonus points. Whoa! Some of these are like proper. Whoa. We're like halfway, I think. Right, so it tells you, I guess, the different varieties that are coming out. I 
I have to say, the haptics feel pretty nice. Are there any in the headset, though? I haven't really been thinking about that. It's quite immersive. Master Chain. Master Chain. Fantastic. I like that there's water, there's reflection on the water from your uh, line. That's cool. Oh. Three chains. Five chains. Energy up. Energy up. Star. Fifteen chains. Wonderful. Bonus point. Five chains. Star. Go on. Nine chains. Star. Bonus point. Star. Energy up. Twenty-five chains. I feel like the music could be a bit Energy varied. Up. I think it's the same music Bonus as the first level, right? Energy up. I mean, it's kind of cool. It's chill. Nine chains. Star. Bonus point. Nine chains. Fourteen chains. Wonderful. Energy up. Four chains. Star. Energy up. Bonus point. Master chain. Fantastic. Fantastic. Energy up. Five chains. Star. I just double click when it's the spreading ones. Maybe I should make them spread out a bit first. Star. Whoa. Great. How does it look on the screen, the social screen? Do the fireworks look bright and colorful? Oh, I guess I could use, I'm using one, but I can actually use both. So I can conduct with both. I just feel like in more control doing it with one. What's this? We have a cutscene? Whoa. Okay. Interesting. Bit of story. A bit of grit in the story. Okay. So there are some kids that have been kidnapped. And we need to save them. Got it. Yeah, I feel like using one is easier. Three chains. Star. Nine chains. Oh. Star. No. Ten chains. Good. Yeah, you can't deselect. Okay, this one is definitely a lot harder. Star. Energy up. 26 chains. Great. Energy up. Bonus points. Star. Bonus points. Star. Energy up. 20 chains. Great. 3 chains. Bonus points. Oh yeah, it's kind of cool. Chains. The levels are... 4 chains. Bonus I mean, there's a load of particle physics by the nature chains. of the game. I just wish the resolution was higher. Three chains. Energy up. Three chains. Oh, there's someone. There's an astronaut. Watch out for the fireworks, Three. astronaut! Six chains. I don't want to burn Star. you! Hey, welcome. Someone just said they just joined and subscribed. Lovely Three to have you here chains. with us. Good. Bonus points. Wow, look at this shit. I gotta say, this game was a pleasant surprise. I was like, I might play it eventually. Wow, we're side. Okay, this is cool. I mean, how? Where are they setting these fireworks off from? How long's the fuse? Three 
Master Chain. Fantastic. Bonus Hunt. Star. Nine Chain. Star. Star. What's that one? Bonus Whoa! Star Mine. Star Mine. I just love how chill it is. Right, there's different colours this time. See, I could use both hands. I just think... Do you know what it is? It's like on Tetris. Um, on Tetris, I always rotate the blocks the same direction. When you become a pro, you start being able to rotate them either way. But it's just so fast, I'm like, no, I just always rotate them clockwise or anti-clockwise. I can't remember what I do. Um, and that's kind of what I'm doing on here. I'm like, just use one hand. I could use both hands, but it's too much to think about. Great. Um, someone just asked me, what do I think about the price? So I paid £15 for this. So someone can correct me. Is it, is it about $20 on the store? So I paid £15 for this. Um, but then, you know, when I think about, like, what is a good price, you know, games, it's always about, like, the amount of content 17. you get. But when it comes to stuff like Tetris Effect or Res Infinite, these are very, like, simple games, like... There's not loads of content, but they are just puzzles that are very immersive Star. in their own way. So, like, £15. If you're into these games, I mean, maybe it's a pretty decent price. Um, this is a, one that a lot of people could just get into. Star. Energy up. Bonus points. 16 chains. There we go, Wonderful. hitting them. Bonus points. Star. Bonus points. Six chains. Three chains. Energy up. Oh, it's permanently dropping 30 to 20. Okay. Seven chains. Interesting. So, yeah, I mean, I always find with these... Star. Well, I always find it hard Energy to recommend up. pricing games. Up. But Too having easy. actually paid £15 myself, I'm Bonus pleasantly point. surprised. Um, 20 chains. Great. Just the whole, like, the way you're tilting. Four chains. Oh, no. Bonus point. Energy up. Star. 19 chains. Wonderful. Three chains. Boom! Star mine again? Or is this a different level? This is a different Star level, mine. is it? I don't know. Whoa. Going the other way now. Oh, it's just greens. Oh, they're coming out the sails of the... Uh... This is awesome. Oh, man. Yeah, just with higher resolution, this would have been... Man, look at them. Just constant chain reactions. I'm just using the fuse button. There we go. Wow. Master chain. It was a master chain of 64. Whoa! I mean, this is awesome. Oh, I cleared the stage. There we go. On we go. I'm really annoyed that the, uh, t the uh, trailer didn't work at the beginning. Nope. Don't need that. Don't need that. Oh, wow. Reminds me of Red Dwarf. Hey. Eleven chains. Good. Bonus point. Bonus point. Energy up. God, it's so satisfying once you get those chains. Master chain. Fantastic. Star. Three chains. Star. Oh, wow. Those Bonus change point. from, like, easy star. into stars. Star. Interesting. Twelve chains. Very good. Very Energy good. Up. Thank you. Energy up. Nineteen chains. Wonderful. Three chains. Energy up. Seven chains. Four chains.
Whoa. All the planets. What's going on? Why is there a fireworks? I mean, I guess if you, if we were in space. What? Wonderful. Bonus point. Energy up. Bonus point. 15 chains. Wonderful. Don't know what's going on now. Game over. Oh, it's game over. Thank you for playing. See wow. Look at this. Look at all the... Uh... I mean, it looks like it's snowing. There we go. Okay, there we go, all right. I love this water and the way it lights up. It's very cool. I mean, that was on easy mode, which makes me wonder. So you have to just complete the game. Right, let's do the how to play. Rules two. Advanced rules two covers the topic of chains. Detonating multiple flares one after another is called a chain. Yep. The chain counter on the left increases as you detonate flares. When the chain ends, the final chain count and bonus points earned will be displayed. Alongside the three basic flare colors, there are also special wild flares. Yeah, which count as any. Wild flares can be matched with any flare color. Yep. They can be captured in any order before detonation. And there is no limit to how many wild flares you can capture at once. However, you can't detonate wild flares without matching them to a color. Additionally, normal flares can only be detonated when matched with other flares of the same color. But wild flares allow you to link up multiple colors before detonation. Does that For mean you example, can do multiple? Wait. Two of the same color so they flares, don't just count as green. You could use it to then do blues as well. Match three. You can then go on to capture flares of a different ah, color. Ah, I didn't know that. That's a good. Oh wow. Once okay, that's totally changed the game for me. More of the new color of flares, you can then detonate everything all at once. Linking up multiple colors of flares in this way and then detonating them is called a daisy chain. Flares detonated in a daisy chain can cause chain reactions this is so soothing. for all I'm so colors tired. involved in the chain. Look at that. A successful daisy chain will earn you special bonus points in addition to the normal chain bonus points. While it isn't easy to pull off a daisy chain, if you do manage to, it will significantly bump up your score. Give it a try once you have a feel for the game. So I was just using the That's wild thing to just match up, like if I only had one blue and I needed an extra one for the three. All right. Is this going to be about the star three, mine? Yeah. You'll learn about items and the star mine bonus round. Items will occasionally appear as you detonate flares. You can use items in various ways, such as in place of a flare or restoring some of the life gauge. Items used as flares will behave like wild flares and can be matched with any color. Detonate them to activate their effects. During any stage, you can also access a special bonus round called Star Mine, in which you can score a lot of extra points. To enter Star Mine, you need several star items. Detonate a star item, and one of the Star Mine lamps at the bottom of the screen will light up. When all lamps have been lit, it's so the star calming. Flare will it genuinely is sending me to sleep, though. Detonate this flare to begin a star mine. 
Star it's weird because it's like, like wild flares. isn't fireworks about being like wow any color. like the type and color get of star mine. this type of color flares that appear in the star mine bonus, bonus round will, will be the be same the as the ones you match the, the star mine flare the with, mine flare with. you could do it less obnoxious than that star mine will last longer the more flares you match with the star mine flare failing to detonate flares however will reduce your remaining time in star mine okay. during star mine Many flares will appear in the sky at once. This is your chance to rack up a lot of bonus points. If you manage to match all three colors of flares with the star mine flare, you can fill the night sky with a magical rainbow of colors. It's not easy to do, but you'll be rewarded with an enormous helping of bonus points if you're successful. Give it a try if you're confident with your skills. This concludes Advanced there Rules we go. 3 on Items and Star Mine. We hope you'll enjoy your time in the wonderful world of Fantavision. Thank you very much. Do I get, do I get a trophy? There we go. Oh in no. No, no, no. Let's have a look at the trophies actually. Items is there a Platinum Star trophy? Mine there is. Found. Wow. 60 items chain other than star mine appear as you detonate flares and it's on each stage you can use wow there's items eight stages in ways such as in place you got to complete them on hard mode or restoring some of the light wow items okay. used as flares and what's extra individual rankings and dynamic mode right Let's just see what dynamic mode is, and then uh, we'll wrap up. Welcome to Fantavision. Please enjoy this fantastic. Oh, it looks mode. like there's a, a grid. It looks like I'm in it. Maybe it's a bit closer to me. So that's why I was able to set them off. Fourteen chains. Wonderful. So this is cool. So you can be in dynamic mode. You're like, you're really in it. I assume that's the only difference with dynamic mode. Well, anyway, this was just going to be a short episode of Let's Play. Um, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. This was Fantavision 2020X. And, uh, yeah, it is a flat screen game that it has a VR mode. And what are my overall thoughts of it? Um, it's fun. I'm having a good time with it. Um, how much fun can I get out of this? Am I going to really push and try and complete the game? You know what? For me, it's definitely not a no. Uh, it might be a no, but uh, this has me curious to keep playing and, and try and racking up those scores. Um, there is something to it. I do like the environments. They're just the whole, the whole uh, city is shimmering. I mean, I don't know what it looks like on the social screen, but in the headset, everything is just shimmering, which is a real shame. I just feel like a game like this, you want just really high visuals and uh, resolution um, because it is about being a visual display. But the fireworks look great. It looks great in the OLED headset. Um, but yeah. Um, I'm, I'm, ha I'm having a good time with this. So, yeah, we'd love to hear your thoughts. Have you ever played Fantavision? Did you ever play it on PSVR 2? This was my first time experiencing it. But I would say, if you are someone that is into the Res Infinites, Tetris effects, all those kind of puzzle games, um, th th this, this will probably uh, appeal to you. Um, I bought it for £15. I think it was uh, it's come down uh, about a third. Um, it's about $20. Um, but all the details in the description of this video, um, do check it out. But thank you so much for joining me on this Let's Play. Uh, do subscribe if you haven't already and ring the bell to be notified about all future Let's Plays because I'm on a mission to Let's Play every single PSVR 2 game out there. And if you're watching live right now, stick around because if you go to my channel, you'll see there's a schedule. Uh, and we've got quite a few Let's Plays today. So um, yeah, do hit the like button before you leave. Thank you, everyone. Uh, shame we couldn't get the, t the um, trailer working at the beginning. I'll definitely do a tech 
another tech test before the next stream. Uh, but yeah, I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye. You know what's weird? You know what's weird? None of the videos are working on my live stream. So it's definitely not the video's fault. It's something with my broadcast system. So I'm just going to pull the plug on the live stream. Take care, everyone. <laughs>